Hey there, so it's Tom Romeo here, and we're going to do beef and broccoli. So you see, I've already got my Chinese broccoli already cut up. I boiled it for about a minute and a half just to get it a little bit tender. And now I've got this nice flank steak that you see I'm shredding, and we're going to cut that nice and thin. Okay, once it's all shredded, move on to step two. Okay, so now we've got all of our beef shredded, sliced real thin. we got our broccoli. We're going to have sesame oil, some tamari, some regular light soy sauce, hoisin sauce, a little cornstarch, and some peanut oil. And here we go to step two. So here we are all measured out. I've got a tablespoon of cornstarch, and that's going to be dissolved in two ounces of water. I've got two ounces of hoisin sauce, and then I've got my meat. And then we've got four ounces of soy sauce and five ounces of water. That's it. Now we're going to start sauteing that meat. Okay. So I've got some, I've got some peanut oil and some sesame oil in there. And now we're going to hit it with some of this shredded flank steak. And the only thing you can't get is the smell of this. I'm not going to use any salt. And I'm going to hit it with some pepper. The reason why I'm not using salt is because we've got soy sauce going in. I'm going to hit it with a little bit of this, just a tiny bit. Oh, of course, it would help if I took the lid off that. I'm going to hit it with a little bit of this onion powder. A little bit of this garlic powder. And that's it. Okay, so here's all the flank steak. It's sauteing. This is four ounces of soy sauce, five ounces of water. And that's why we didn't put salt. This is two ounces of hoisin sauce. And that's never easy to get it all in there, but we do our best. All right, so as soon as we see that the uh, soy sauce and water are about to boil, I'm gonna take this cornstarch and I'm gonna mix with it two ounces of water and I'm just going to stir that up okay and once it's all dissolved I'm going to add that to the liquid and that is going to thicken it up nicely once we get a little bit of thickening going on then we throw the broccoli in and we're done Pretty simple, right? Okay, can you see how it is a little bit thickened, right? You see how that's nice? 
Now we throw in, we throw in the broccoli. And this is just Chinese broccoli that I cooked for about a minute and a half. I put it in hot boiling water. Well, hot boiling water, that's redundant. Um, and then I took it out right away and then cut it into little pieces. And that's it. Beef and broccoli. Last step. Sesame seeds. That's it. And now we just let it sit. 